and we're a go. Hey, all my future weirdos. I'm here with my favorite. Tony. She's not really my favorite. I'm just saying this for the sake of the video. So let's just go with it. Mm -mm. I'm just kidding. Tony really is my bestest, best, best friend in the whole wide world. But all jokes aside, she really is my best friend. And she's been my best friend since. Seventh grade, yes, got that one. But look at us all these years later, still going strong. Unlike all the fake people out there. Mm, we ain't gonna say no names though. Mm, 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 but enough of us being black girls, which we partially are. Shall we get to the topic for today, children? You see this, this wasn't planned. You're going to be seeing me doing a lot of weird stuff today. So you guys better be prepared. But today we're talking about... We've been hearing too much about these thoughts. And we are getting sick of it. Mm -hmm. Thoughts is the most overused word of life now. Thought, thoughties, she a thought, he a thought. Everybody's a thought if that's the case. Right. And all these unnecessary thought pages. Thornridge thought, Thornwood thought, Thornton thought, Dalton thought, Harvey Riverdale thought, thought, Riverdale thought, Riverdale thought. Too many thought pages. Dang. Come on. Come on, people. Get your life. Stop it. And once you got your life, you can give us a call. Because we are sick and tired of hearing the word thought. We're sick and tired of seeing all these thought pages. We're just sick and tired of all of it. So once you finally get your life mm -hmm. away from saying the word thought, then you can give us a call. Mm -hmm. We have 24 hours. Seven days a week. Mm -hmm. 365 days mm -hmm. a year, 525,600 mm -hmm. minutes. So once you get it together, world, and realize that thought is the most relevant word of life, give us a call. Yep, that's all we want. That's all we need. As always, how about we go to the proper urban dictionary definition of a thought? How about we use our own definition? Let's give it a go. All right. So what is a thought to you, Tony? A thought to me is a home wrecker, having sex with too many people, mm, still other people's man. Mm. What's your definition? <sighs> Do you need help? Thank. <laughs> but my definition of a thought is. My definition is kind of lame, so let me just go to Urban Dictionary. Let me just keep it real. Let me just go to Urban Dictionary like I was going to do it. A thought is an individual with a number of concurrent sex partners that is well above the established cultural norm. These individuals have coitus for the purpose of sexual pleasure, approval, and to fulfill emotional void. These individuals may or may not have sexually transmitted infections. However, this term still applies to horrors that practice safe sex. These acts are not to exchange for illicit narcotics or monetary economic gain as observed by in prostitutes, crackheads, junkies. Mm. Urban Dictionary got real and Tony got creepy. Yeah, I don't know who I am. But all jokes aside, we are seriously sick of hearing the word thought. Please stop with the word thought. We get the new slang words have to come out, but there should seriously be a line drawn in the sand. Thought is basically the same thing as a hoe. So why not just keep it simple and say hoe instead of adding extra letters and saying thoughts? Right? Oh, right? Oh. Right? Bye. Bye. And if we band together on one accord, we can stop the word thought from being used. Thank you guys so much for checking out this video. If you'd like to give it a thumbs up, add it to your favorites, share it with your friends, and subscribe for all this craziness right here. Hi. And also thank you to my very special guest, Tony, for joining me today. I want to give a shout out to Pookie and Ray Ray. Girl, don't be ratchet. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Bye. And as always, I will see you next time. I reiterate you, my future weirdos. Shh.